Hey there, everybody. Welcome back to Alien Isolation Part 2. Uh, I did some tinkering with my recording software and some hardware as well. And I'm actually encoding uh, at a higher setting and using a different core on my motherboard. So you should get better looking, smoother gameplay. And it's at 60 FPS now, which is always good. So, uh, yeah, I noticed some... some uh, lag discrepancies in the recording on the last video so that should be fixed now what do we say this code was oh that's oh, okay oh three four oh yeah that's right we remembered got a med kit What's in here? We got a blueprint for a med kit, not an actual med kit. Take a charge pack. Okay, the people went this way. And the door doesn't even work. Great. Okay, this door works. I guess we're not following the people. We should probably crouch under the sparky sparks. Ah, oh, shit. I still stood up in too freaking early. God dang it. Uh, I'm so impatient. That's part of the problem with these stealth games in me is I just don't want to take the time to... What the hell happened here? Uh, that's a good question. I wonder what what happened here. Could it be an alien? I think an alien happened here. This must have been some kind of like market exchange or something. Oh, hey, there's my ship. The turrets. Hey, ship. Hey, do you see me? Ah, shit. It didn't close the goddamn door on us. We can't wave to our ship anymore. Fuck. Fucking lights. Play some pool. A flare. That's an air hockey table, not a pool table. I'm an idiot. Generator. Pump that shit. Pump it. Okay. Let there be light. Oh, that's cool. Can we play a game? Run around Rex. I don't remember this. What is up with that light? It's dancing by itself. Weird little messed up light. Drew Reed Jones, today's update. After numerous demands, Marsha Wade finally called a public meeting to address the rumors that have been circulating on Sevastopol. But instead of the answers we wanted, he continued to be evasive, and after only a few minutes, he and his team were pelted by projectiles from an angry crowd. A gun was fired, there was panic, and now Wade and what's left of his team are forcibly ejecting us from the terminal. Feels like we're on our own now. Okay, well, good thing you left that recording behind. Zoe, I'm sorry, but I won't need you to come in next week. As you know, the store's been in trouble for some time now, and I couldn't hold off the creditors any longer. There's just no one coming to Sevastopol anymore. It's not just us, either. It sounds like the whole station is in the red, and they're pulling the plug. We're gonna sell it off for scrap, I guess. I was speaking to one of the engineers, and he reckons they'll announce it soon. I'm telling you... I'm telling you this so you don't stick 
around looking for another job. Sevastopol's finished. Time to move on. Harper. Oh, there was something else. I didn't mean to back all the way out. Shared. To all spaceflight terminal employees in the interest of public safety and the prevention of panic, it must be made clear to all potential passengers that there are currently no scheduled flights leaving Sepestopol, nor ships available. Colonial marshals are investigating problems on station and will update accordingly. What is Apollo? What is Apollo? Apollo is the central AI that monitors and provides guidance for all the Sikhs and working Joes on Sevastopol. Apollo also oversees all communications on the station, so wherever you are, you know you're in safe hands. Well, I can tell you for a fact that the working Joes on this space station are a bitch. Let's open this vent. What made the lights move? Climb out. Now where the hell are we? This whole damn place is falling apart. Guess I gotta go up this. More sparks, my arch nemesis sparks. What the hell is that sound? What the fuck? Stop coughing, you're gonna draw attention to us. I got chills from that one. That dude running by looked really, really shady. He had to have gone this way. How did he disappear so freaking quick? Looks like I should be able to use that to illuminate this room better. Oh shit, is that a body? It's a body. Oh my god, there's a lot of bodies. I don't remember this either. Uh, we'll go this way first and see what we can find. It's like a cat. Like a little kitty cat. Making sure I'm not missing anything in the dark. Already and pump it louder. Pump it louder. Pump it louder. What did I open up over here? Any goodies? Are there any goodies? on here and shit. People have been living here. And these doors are locked. What's this? An ion torch. Oh, there's a dead guy. Found us a dead guy. How do I get the torch? Plasma torch, ion torch. Glow jobby torch. Maintenance jack. Like, you just gotta have a million different t tools to get around in this bitch.
I feel like I should have found it. Hey. Wait a minute. Was this cracked before? I don't feel like it was. Let's make us a med kit. Necessary parts. How do I use the med kit? M? No. Okay, this is saying I need to go down this hallway to the right and then look to the left. That's where this is, but I don't have a maintenance jack. Is there a different way in there? I don't know how I'm going to get in there. Is there a an asshole vent to go in? <sighs> I'm thinking about turning the game brightness up a little bit because the dark areas are still really, really dark. Let's go back to where we were, see if we can't find the baggage area. Up! Ah! God damn it, game. Ugh. God. So I have a condition, and I'm just gonna be honest with you now. That's gotta be the exit up ahead. Sometimes when I get scared, I fart. But I'll edit that out, I think. Because it's pretty gross. I'm like that guy from Master of Disguise, except it's not when I laugh, it's, it's when I get scared. Here's a save station. I don't need to hide. Save game. Yes. Another maintenance check is required. Heard something. I'm just hitting it button on everything, trying to figure out what turns the freaking lights on in this room. Looks like somebody got eaten right here, or murdered right there by something. Let's try this way. <clears throat> uh, there it is. I wonder if this is a throwback to the movie uh, a Sphere. I love the I like any Michael Crichton book film adaptation. Oh, fuck. Well, I've already seen a dead body. This one shouldn't be too big of a surprise. But into the asshole we go. Okay. We're locked in here with the corpse. Rulo, I want to make a complaint to the, the highest authority, okay? My name is Zach 
Zachary Watson. That's Watson. You get that? My complaint is this. Fucking marshals. They should be protecting us. It's their job. Something's on this station with us, and no one knows what it is. No one fucking knows. I know. They put braces on the doors. Locked out. You know, like to keep something out. I'm fucking terrified. Are you Watson? Don't mind if I take this, do you? Ew. I think I need this one more, do you? Freaky ass bugs. Remove a brace. Hold right and left mouse button and press A. All right, we've got ourselves the maintenance jack. Let's go back. What just made all those cap? Something just made all that shit fly away. I don't know what it was. Remove brace. Some crafting stuff and another audio log. Interview subject. Heist. Did I say that right? Heist? Look, if you can't even tell me your name, we're gonna be here a hell of a long time. I just wanna know about your boss. He's got you all into a lot of trouble. Someone's gonna be accountable. I'm gonna make damn sure someone's accountable. I don't remember this room being open, but here's another one. First, it's Turner. Gotta deal with that wasted asshole again. This time, he nearly wrecked the door with a maintenance jack. Guess he figures it's safe here. He'll have to lock himself in. Screw him. We got too much to worry about without babysitting drunks. Anyway, I threw him in the evidence lockup. Let the son of a bitch sleep it off. All right, let's save our game. Back where we came. This space station is just full of porn. Like, what do you get? Should I go this way first, or there was a one door that? Oh, I heard the body I walked on. Let's go back this way. And open that one door that had a brace on it. Yeah, this one. And just see what happens. I'm hearing lots of sounds. Collect a blasting cap. This is kind of weird 3D printer. Ethanol. I'm gonna make a Molotov cocktail. Oh, well, hell, there's nothing else in here. I'm pretty sure the other two doors required a. That one required a torch. That one requires a torch. Okay. So I guess we've got to go back out that big door.
A cutscene. Uh oh. Still. Okay. Okay. Uh, turn around. Come on! Ah, uh, I just Where got that. You? Where'd you come from? Ripley. Off station. A ship. There's no ships here. There are now. Well, huh, that's good news. Because things are not so good here. Something flew just now. Rocked this whole place. I saw it. But lady, that's the least of our problems. Yeah? Yeah. Something goes on this station. Something you wouldn't believe. Like what? A killer. You get it? Okay. What's your name? Axel. I was boarding with two colleagues. EVA. We got separated by the blast. Can you help me find them? Why? Because you seem to know your way around. Well, I, but why? What's in it for me? The place on the ship. How do I know I can trust you? I need to find comms. I need to contact my ship. All right. Comms is in the Cystex bio. It's quite a distance, but we can get to a transit through the freight area. But watch yourself. We can get in all sorts of trouble here. Okay. Yeah, we'll get in trouble, all right. Let me tell you right now. Don't try to fuck me. Come on, I don't want to stick it. I'm not that kind of Ripley. Are you following me back there? I have to keep my distance. I can't take any chances. So he was following me. It's really dark in here. Inquisitive type, eh? Stick close to me. What? Okay, sorry. Hey, don't move. Oh, oh, okay, okay. We're not looking for trouble. Who are you? I'm John. This is Ringo. We're just some assholes. We haven't got time for this. I want in there. Jenna. We're trying to get to comms. Can you help us? We don't need their help. Don't tell them anything. Look, I've got the elevator working. Jana, let's go, okay? I... I'm sorry. Good luck. Should we ride the elevator? What the hell was that about? Why are you so damn aggressive? Everyone's running shit scared. Keep them to their own. It's safer that way. All right, dude, lead the way. I hope this ship of yours is the real McCoy. Oh, I like this fog. It looks so good. Hold up. Let me get the elevator. Allow me. Place is over. Needs a special touch. Well, what are you waiting for? I thought you were going to do it, jackass. I'd appreciate it if you told me what the hell was going on right now. Listen, pal. When we get to the ship, we can kick back, braid each other's hair, and chat all you want. Yeah, when we get to my ship. I need to know what's going on right fucking now. Like I said, there's a killer. A killer? What does that even mean? I ain't seen it, but it's here. Picking us off one by one. What are you saying? A psycho? A person? No. Something else. A monster. I don't believe in monsters. But I do believe in aliens. True story. My Jesus. 
I hate when you have to. Fo I hate games where you have to follow Shit. somebody. We need to move. This way. But you walk Get faster down. than them. This is bullshit, Barry. You should be looking for a way off. Are you crazy? There's no way off. At least we're safe down here. For how long? What if they come for us? Then we shoot the crap out of them. Now shut up. You're making me nervous. Mm, they're trigger happy. That's not good. And just like me right now, my the sphincter is locked. You'll have to go right the It's been clenched. Follow, Follow Axel into the sphincter. Friends of yours? I've had run into those guys before. They don't like strangers. Just grab his freaking gun. I'm shocked. Chain, darling. You want to go and say hello? It's your funeral. Those guns aren't for show. Someone should be doing something. They are. Oh, it's Jesus. Called surviving. Everyone's turning on each other. The fear, it makes people crazy. I've noticed. You've been living here? What can I say? My butler's on holiday. Grab what you need. I don't know when you'll get another chance. There's nothing else in here. I just took some... Some bonding agent, but there's nothing else. Waiting for a ship. Waiting for you, I guess. I hear some shit. A sensor. It can get very dark around here. You should take that flashlight over there. Ethanol. Sure you're stocked up on batteries. Flashlight batteries and a flashlight. How do you use it? Be careful not to flash it around. We don't want to get caught. Let's go. Okay. F turns it on and off. Okay. All right. Well, I feel like this one has this gone on for a while, so we will uh, save our game. And we'll call it here. I know the alien's getting close. We're going to see it soon enough, I'm sure. If memory serves me right, it is about to, to make its appearance in probably the next episode. Uh, tail end of the next episode, I'd say. All right, guys. Thanks for sticking around. I'll see you in part three. Bye.